And here we go again, another attack in France, a terrorist attack over religion. Sees tonight the horrific terror attack at a church in Nice, France. The president of France tonight saying we are under attack. ABC's Maggie Ruley is there for us. Tonight, France on its highest terror alert level after a deadly rampage inside a church. Authorities say a young man stabbed several people inside the Notre Dame Basilica in Nice this morning, killing three, one woman nearly decapitated. This 55-year-old father of two among the dead. <laughs> Officers storming the church, opening fire on the suspect, taking him into custody. Police say the 21-year-old attacker was born in Tunisia and was unknown to the intelligence community. Authorities finding a copy of the Quran near the suspect. Tonight, French President Emmanuel Macron deploying an additional 4,000 soldiers to schools and places of worship, saying the country is under attack. <laughs> France fighting a surge in terror attacks in recent weeks. Just two weeks ago, near Paris, investigators say a man beheaded a teacher who showed his class the controversial cartoons of the Prophet Muhammad, published by the satirical newspaper Charlie Hebdo in a lesson about free speech. And Macron is doubling down tonight, calling today's attack an Islamist terror attack, the third here in France in just the last two months. Tonight, this country is bracing for even more violence. But David, many Muslim nations have come forward today, including Egypt and Turkey, condemning this horrible attack. David. All right, Maggie Ruley in Nice for us. Maggie, thank you. And it's not the only crisis they're facing in France tonight and across Europe for that matter. The deadly second wave of the virus. French President Emmanuel Macron saying the virus is spreading faster than even the most pessimistic forecasts. New lockdowns tonight in France, in Germany, and this evening in Belgium. Just.